Hey, what's up, what's up, man? So, Rena Vincent up in this motherfucker. Once again, man, I'm going to give you my 2016-2017 college playoff football national championship game pick results. And I'll give you some reaction to it, too. All right, man, as you know, if you watched the other video before, you know what I mean? To all the subscribers out there, you know, much love. <laughs> anyway, but like I said, I picked the Clemson Tigers to defeat the Alabama Crimson Tide. And guess what? Clemson Tigers came through and defeated Alabama and got that victory, baby. Took home that trophy. Um, at the end, man, like, again, I was listening to the game on the radio. That game seemed good, man. It was going back and forth. On half, I think it was, like, around third quarter. It was a bit like 7-14 or, like, around halftime. It was 7-14, to man. So it was still a good game. You know what I mean? And at first it looked like Alabama was going to win it, going to take control of the game and, uh, you know, slow it down a little bit. But Cle Clemson came back. And at the end, Clemson just got that touchdown and got that victory, baby. They could have tied it up maybe with a field goal. They got a field goal position, but they went for the killer. They went for the motherfucking kill shot, and they got it, baby. So congratulations to Clemson Tigers. Congratulations to me because I got that pick right. And overall picks, man, last year's pick, when I made last year's pick, I picked Alabama to lose too, but I got the one wrong. This year I got it right. And um, so I'm one in, I'm one in one, baby, overall. Lifetime and picking national championship games on one and one. And hey, that's cool. That's a 500 record, baby. <laughs> that's right. Let me give you my thoughts about the game. Uh, first of all, I'm giving you my thoughts about Alabama. Uh, Alabama's coaching staff, I mean, offensive coordinator Lane Kiffin, now he left and went to his other job. But to me, that's some bullshit, homie. If you, gotta, if you are with that team, this is a national championship game, motherfucker. You don't go up and leave to go to your other school before the season's over. The season wasn't over. You know what I mean? This is a national championship game. Your ass should have been on the sideline calling plays, and Steve Sarkeesian should have still been up there. You know what I mean? Maybe you wanted to make room. Maybe you left and took your other job real quick so Steve Sarkeesian can be the offensive coordinator. That's cool. Maybe you're showing up for your buddy. But still, man, that's some bullshit, man. You should have been on the sideline. Maybe the game would have been different. Maybe Alabama would have won. But to me, when coaches half-ass it, when the coaches leave, I noticed that. I've been noticing that for the past for a couple years already, man. Be coaches be getting promotions and all that, they leave to another school or leave the NFL or leave somewhere and leave the fucking team behind. And like, they don't, coach, they don't coach the bowl game. In this instance, Lane Kiffin wasn't the offensive coordinator. At the national championship game, man, this is a motherfucking, motherfucking ring for back-to-back -back national championships. This is up and left, man. To me, that's not cool, man. You should be sticking it. Wait, how you going to tell your damn students, I mean, damn, you know, student-athlete motherfuckers, that, oh, yeah, it's okay. As soon as you get that promotion, just up and leave everything. Now nah, you got to put, you got to close that book. You got to finish it, man. So, to me, that was, that was the only thing I was disappointed in. Lane Kiffin leaving, you know. Steve Sarkisian did a decent job, but I guess it was Alabama's defense that just couldn't hold those damn Crimson, those um, Clemson Tigers, man. So, it's all good, but those are my two cents. To me, if you're a coach, stick to it. Stick with the motherfucking school that gave you that shot. And then move on to the NFL or move on to the other school or move on to your head coaching gig, all right? You know what I mean? That's my thing. That's the only thing I got to say about that shit. But anyway, so Reno Vincent, my results. I got this Got this victory. I got this pick right. And overall, one and one, picking national championship games. And I'll probably pop up my overall record um, for the bowl season, 2016-2017 bowl season at a later date, baby. But you know what to do. So Reno Vincent, give me that like, give me that share. Leave the comments below. Vincent365 Production. No Velo. And as always, thank you for exploring the arena we call life with your homie, Arena Vincent. Peace.